We're solving problem 17 from the fall AMC 12A from 2021. For how many orders, ordered pairs B of B and C of positive integers does neither x squared plus b plus c equal 0 nor x squared plus cx plus b equal 0 have two distinct real solutions? So these are quadratics, and there's a way you can interpret them using the quadratic formula. Now, there's the square root on the numerator. That is called the delta x. If it is greater than 0, it has two solutions. If it is equal to 0, it has one. Um, but, and if it's less than 0, it has none. So you want it to have, you do not want it to have two solutions, so either one or zero solutions. So let's derive this first case. The delta x is going to be b squared minus 4c. This has to be less than or equal to 0. And you can derive that this here, c squared minus 4b, is also less than or equal to 0. This is a particularly weird case, as both of these are equal to 0. But, <clears throat> let's see here. Well, well, if you simply just subtract, or you add these two cases together, it's still going to be 0. And then you move all these two things to the other side. Well, now that's we're getting somewhere. This is going to be b squared plus c squared less than or equal to 4 times c plus b. Okay, that's when you add these two together. And again, move these 4c and 4b to the other side. Now, <clears throat> there's a clear solution. These are equal, equal when b equals c equals 4. So therefore, the greatest, greatest is 4 comma 4 are paired integers. So you can just test these values to see which ones work. So I'm just going to list them out. There's 1 comma 1, 2 comma 1, 1 comma 2, as you can switch these around, 2 comma 2, 3 comma 3, and lastly, 4 comma 4. When you uh, count all these up, you get that this will have six solutions for this problem.